Hey, good morning. So I wanted to um, talk real quick about trauma. And I'm thinking as I'm, because I don't have anything written. So um, about trauma and how we think we ready. <laughs> like you think you're ready, but you have no idea, right? That, that MTV true life type of situation. So why I say that is because so many of us want to so I think of us as trees, right? We're we're trees, and this is the um, this is the um, the grass part, right? And so our roots are down here, and here we are as the tree. And so I guess like that as the tree. And so so many of us are like, I'm ready to go down. I want to talk about all this stuff that happened whenever I was younger. Da -da -da. And sometimes we do need to get our story out. I understand that sometimes you need to be able to tell your story, but some of us are telling our story on a loop where we're always telling it and that's energy y'all you're giving away your energy like each time you do that and you're not doing it in a context of where it's healing you're giving your energy away so what um i always suggest is if this is the um this is the soil you got a lot of weeds up here that are probably some that's probably already like going up and trying to uh take over the branch take over the, the tree, take over the tree. So if you look, I'm running out of stuff. So here's you as the, um, the tree. Oh, y'all can't see. It. Here's you as the tree. Here's your, this is where your roots are going. And so now you got all this, these weeds trying to come up and take over. Whitney, what are the weeds? Let me tell you what the weeds are, girlfriend. The weeds are the people, places, and things that are no longer serving you. This the things that we keep around us with the behaviors that we need to be working on and instead of weed eating, we tend to let them overcrowd us. And at times they can start to, to pull us down. Like you ever seen, well, you know, like sometimes whenever you look at bushes that are like go, or vines that like take over trees and suffocate them is how I'm picturing it. Like suffocating them and taking over and like holding on strong to stuff. That's like the people, places, and things that we keep in our life. And that's what it's doing to us. So I know you're ready. I know you're, some of y'all are thinking you're ready. I want to talk about the trauma. So go to a professional. And yes, if you need to get the story out, go to the professional to get the story out so you can go, huh. okay, then it's time to do the work. The work isn't always necessarily, this is work down below the surface. Oh yeah, that's work. That's a deep spiritual work. But you got a lot to do up here before you even get here. So focus on this. Focus on the weeds that you got going on. Focus on the people, places, and things that are um, pulling you down, holding you back. The behaviors in these people, places, and things, not necessarily the people. Because I don't want you to think, like, I need to cut them off. Cut them. What are the behaviors they're looking at? Are they displaying? Um, so that way you can start to focus on you. And you can start to take care of yourself physically. So what are you eating? Making sure you're drinking well. Uh, making sure that you're working the body out, like all that stuff happens. Because what happens is whenever you go down and you want to work on this, the body has a reaction. So the body is going to start act reacting to all the traumas and things that came that you went through. And if you're not eating well, you're not taking care of the physical body by ex any type of movement and you're not drinking enough water and doing what you need to do to stabilize yourself. You can put yourself into something. You can have a, you know, a crook in your neck or you can get a cramp somewhere, you know, like the body is going to react. So my, um, my, uh, thought, my, my, so my word to you is to take care of the, the surface part so that when it's time to go down deep, you'll be ready for it. Don't think that you're ready when you're really not. If you, if you aren't taking care of the body and getting yourself stable and getting to know you and your body and how it reacts to stress, you're not ready for this. And I only say that because I know been there, done that. And I don't want you to also go through the same thinking that you're ready to talk about all this stuff that happened when you're not, you're ready to start dealing with this. You're ready to start getting up the weeds and doing what you need to do to get them out of your garden or out of your, yeah, out of your area before you go down deep and want to really tackle some stuff that you think you're ready for, but physically you may not be. So, all right. So what I have for today. I hope that you have a great day. I hope you have a fabulous day and I hope that you're taking care of yourself, getting to know who you are, taking care of the body, mind, and your spirit. All right. Peace.